In this video, we're going to look at the volume and surface area of a sphere. So in a sphere, you will first need to find out the radius. And once you have that, the volume is 4 over 3 times pi r to the power of 3. And the surface area equals 4 times pi r squared. Now, at the actual GMAT exam, when you get a test on a sphere, they will tell you what the radius is. Let's say it's 3 here. And they will ask you to calculate the volume. So the volume is 4 over 3 times pi times r to the power of 3. So if we cross this out, we get 4 pi times 3 squared. So we get 36 pi. So this is the volume of the sphere. Now next, let's look at the area of a rectangle and a square. Now, a rectangle or a square has two sides, A, B, so area becomes A times B, and a square e equals A squared. Now, in a square or a rectangle, you will have a length and a width. Of course, this two can switch sides, so it doesn't matter which one you call it width and which one you call it length. So make sure to remember these basic equations.